Elizabeth! Oh. Emily? Emily? Hey. Hey. Somebody help me! She's pinned. Let's check her. Is she gonna make it? You need to get out of here. And get that wound checked. Or it'll be you we find her on the Listen, next Listen, I'm looking for my wife and my sister. We've rescued a number of people. Maybe they're out already. You take care of her. Blocking the hatch. There's no way to pry these doors open. Where do you think we are? I, don't know, I think I think maybe the basement. Okay, so how do we get out of here? I'm just gonna have to wait for the fire crews. They're gonna find us eventually. What if the building is burning? Okay, the cops would have shut off the gas main within the first hour to reduce the risk of fire. Okay. Lobby's flame-proof. After what happened at Port Charles Hotel, Jax wasn't going to take any chances. So we're relatively safe, right? Well, I mean, it depends on how much structural damage from the explosion. Do you, do you think the hotel collapsed? No, I doubt it. But there is no telling how much debris is on top of us or how long it's going to take for them to dig us out. I'm sorry. Sorry for what? I knew I couldn't get you out of the lobby before the explosion, so... When Craig's people started shooting, there was so much chaos, I couldn't, I, I couldn't even see which way to run. How did you find me? I was sure. I was. I was positive that they would wait for the vault to open the storm in the lobby. That's why I sent Sam out there to, to warn them. Well, then she must have made it. I mean, she has a, a better chance than anyone else. But Was closest to the door. It's not necessarily an advantage. You know, Craig's people were shooting, the cops were shooting, SWAT was there, it was dark. Jesus. There was. I'm sorry. Emily and, and Nicholas. Oh God, and Lulu. She was mean and mean. That you're scared. The only person you can help is your baby. So just try to stay calm, okay? You're scared, aren't you? I just don't want to lose anyone I care about. We need a medic! Right now! We need a medic! You gotta stop yelling. Hey. Hi. You scared the hell out of me. Are you okay? I'm, I'm f Are you okay? I think so. I think I'm okay. Thank God you're alive.
Matt, have you seen Lulu? No, nothing. No. Matt said he'd call if he found Lulu or Maxie. What kind of damage is done to the lobby? I don't know. They won't let us close. We can't hey, see hey, what's hey, going on. Hey, we need your help. But you to listen to Epiphany and help with the engine coming out of the hotel. You pay attention to her and no one else. Now, you heard the doctor. We need blankets. Let's get busy. Come on. Everyone. You are still critical. You can only have one visitor at a time. What happened at the hotel? Emily was one of the hostages. Yeah, it's all it's all over, Helen. It's all over. The police made it into the lobby. It was terrible, Monica. Those good men, they treated us like animals. They shot Robin. It's okay. It's okay, Alan. You are safe now. It's all right. Everyone thought she was going to die. But Nicholas told me that Emily saved her life. She's always been such a blessing to us, Monica. I want to tell her. She's going to be here just as soon as she can. I thought, I thought that Jason would come to help us. What well, with his sister and Sam being there and, and Carly and Sonny... I wonder why he never came. I feel so sick about Cameron. I cannot believe that I do not have a will saying that I want him to go to my grandmother. It would be just like my sister Sarah to swoop down and, and insist that she's the one to raise him. But I can't imagine him growing up without me. And his mom. And he needs me. And I promised myself that if I were to live through this, that I would do better, that I would do better for, for Cameron and this new baby, and, and that I wouldn't lie anymore, and that I would stop rationalizing and making excuses. Because because we're we're going to get out of this. We, we can breathe. It's more proof that there's no fire. You're going to be okay. Somebody is going to find us. The other hostages will know I'm not one of them. The other hostages never saw your face. All you have to do is act like you were some hotel guest and you were hiding in the bathroom the whole time. Is that what you want me to tell the cops? That I was hiding from Craig and these guys in the john? You don't have to tell them anything. Just act like you're out of it from the blast. And as soon as you get a chance, walk away all calm and quiet like nothing happened. In the confusion, no one will even notice you're gone. Why are you doing this for me? Because you didn't shoot me when I got you locked in the vault, and you didn't press the detonator when Mr. Craig yelled at you. You're not a bad person. You just have really bad judgment sometimes, and I know what that's like. Somebody there? Yeah, we're we're hostages. Can you get us out of here? Are you okay? Yeah. My name is Maxie Jones. My dad's Max Scorpio. Can you help us? Mrs. Jones, follow me. Watch your step. Can you stand? I think so. Did Lulu get out? What about Jason? Oh my God! Right, listen, to me. listen, listen. We gotta get out of here, Michael and Morgan. They need us alive, okay? Hey, I paged Dr. Rosenthal in the prepping in OR. Has she been conscious at all? Not since Nicholas brought her out of the lobby. Is it true they operated on her in the hotel lobby? I talked to you, Emily, and Robin would have left that. Where the hell is Rosenthal? On his way. Robin is going to be okay now, Patrick. She needs to get to the OR. Do they know she's dealing with immunocompromise? She's probably got early peritonitis and hypovolemia. Did you ever say please? Jason probably saved me by sending me out. I should have gone back in there. I doubt that Jason would want you to do that, Sam. Yeah, I can't say I blame her. You guys are fortunate to be alive. I need you to just be grateful for that for about five minutes, okay? It's a very normal reaction if you're guilty. Well, I understand that, Lainey. I just don't want them to do anything stupid like go back into that building because you are a father, and I don't think Emily would want you to risk Spencer becoming an orphan, especially since there's nothing that you can do anyway. Everything that's, that can be done is being done. Are you listening to yourself lecturing us on taking chances? You should be in the hospital yeah. or you should be in bed. I'm hoping that you'll stay put if you think of me as the needy cancer patient. Where is she? 
Listen, I need you want to know that I found Emily. Where? Where is she? Listen, the paramedics are helping out. She was under some rubble. No. Don't you tell me. Don't you? Listen Don't to you me. Don't you tell me. She had a pulse. She was just unconscious. Wait, what about Josiah? I'm going to look for him. When I go back in, I have to find Elizabeth and Lulu. Nicholas. to lose your sister your two best friends first girl you ever loved not to mention Sam I'm sure she got out I'm, I'm sure they all got out I got I got to the lobby minutes after Craig took over doors were darkened and, and I I saw a gunman through an open spot in the paint Cops showed up. I knew they were going to follow their protocol. And when they did, everybody in that lobby would be trapped. That's that's why I called Spinelli. That's how Spinelli got in the hotel because he's working with you. Yeah, I I needed tech support. <laughs> uh, you, you and Spinelli make a very interesting team. Okay, thank you. <laughs> um, it's for the computer. Okay, the guy can do anything. I mean, he pulled up footage of the lobby cameras before they were blackened. I could see Alan and Emily and Robin and Sam and Sonny and Carly and you. You know, I kept making Spinelli play the footage over and over and over, and I told him it was it was to study Craig when really I just wanted I needed. To see all of you alive, to, you know, believe I could keep it that way. Well, you did everything you could. Waited too long. Are you telling me you think you did something wrong in there? Lulu is still in there. I know. They're going to move a lot as fast as they can. Why the cops not? Well, I'm going in after her and you're going to help me. These people are equal opportunity rescuers. Lulu is my priority. I'm betting she's yours too. Now help me. Who's? Help me. There's nothing. Okay, now these supplies are not going to move themselves. So get busy. Make yourself useful. Dylan? Dylan, get back here, you little bastard! Hey, oh, wait. I'll be right back. Thanks. Sorry about the bastard. Yeah, get Lulu out of there. Ah, cool. So much for my promise to Mac. He knows what he's doing, okay? Yeah, that's great for Elizabeth and Lulu. What about Maxie, who's in that building that cares about her? 